Add-ons can be huge time saver, so today I will introduce you to some of the free add-ons and tools which can highly increase your productivity. With that being said let's get into it. First up, we have Blender S Electric Line Generator, which is based on geometry nodes. These generators contain a variety of wire types and pole types. Moreover, because it is based on a curve, you can move it around and extend it for extra length. Changes can be made to the distance between the poles, the pole's rotation, and the length of the two wires. And also there is a wind animation, you can adjust the wind's power, direction, and speed, and the wires will respond to those adjustments. There are also some other options that you can consider. Additionally, everything is always changeable because it is node-based. This is a fairly large material pack for Blender that contains 800 procedural materials. This pack, which was originally made by Meta Androcto, is made to work with Blender 3.0 or above. These textures are compatible with Cycles and as well as EV. Since they are procedural texture which you can modify anything you want. These textures come under CCO license. If you want to use it quickly and efficiently, you may add it to your asset library and after you have added it your asset library, you can just drag and drop it to your models and the textures will be applied to it. Although this pack includes 800 free procedural materials, the paid version also includes over $300 worth of add-ons just for $30. This space station generator was created by Curry's Holt. You may already know him since he is a quite famous YouTuber. You must use Blender 2.9 to use this add-on because it only functions with that version. However, you can always create the mesh, export it, and use it in the Blender version you prefer. You should first open the .blend file in order to use this add-on. Then, once it has been opened, go to the script window, press text, and then select run script. As soon as your script has finished running, Go ahead and type Start Generation Procedure into the search bar by pressing F3. You supposedly have a new space station. This add-on already contains textures and a world shader, which you can customize to generate a new scene. You can also model some modules for yourself. And for more information, See the Chris Holt tutorial on this add-on. The links are in the description. This engine generator add-on was created by Digital Pottery. With the help of this add-on, you can create very realistic functioning engines which then you can use in your visualization and design work for automobiles. Additionally, this add-on includes pre-made textures and an animation scene that you can customize to create your own animation. In the modifiers tab, you have the option to change a lot of things, including engine speed, each piston's offset, the number of gears, and some spring settings. Alternately, you can alter everything, including many of the shapes using geometry nodes. Although the geometry nodes are a little disorganized, working with them is still very simple. There is a detailed tutorial showing how this add-on was created. You can watch that tutorial on the creator's channels, the link will be in the description. I now have Alex Martinelli's Cool Spider Web add-on. You can use this add-on to create super customizable spider web. There are numerous settings that can be changed to generate different outcomes each time. Various factors are adjustable, like the number of circles, the size of the web, the amount of noise, the location of the center, and gravity. It has some other factors which can be changed to produce different outcomes. It includes a very well-organized and not overly complicated geometry node setup that you can use to customize further. This add-on only works in Blender 3.1 or above. And there you have it. Best 5 free add-ons for Blender that will help you increase your productivity and enhance your workflow. I hope you enjoyed this video and found these add-ons useful, if you did, please consider subscribing to our channel. If you have any questions or want to share your experience with these add-ons,
please leave a comment below or you can join our newly established Discord server and be a part of our new community.